right, we're inside the car show. <laughs> Some kind of dance dance. We got Nissan, it looks like, sitting here. Centro, maybe. Sunny Q Series, never heard. Not an interesting car, who cares? <coughs> Some Nissan truck over here, maybe like a patrol type car. Let's see. It's called a Navara. Also never heard of a Navara. Let's see. Let's see the spec sheet on the Navara. 2.5. Oh, it's decent. So it's a diesel, which is pretty cool. You see a turbocharger tucked in back there. It's the black edition. Seems just like a Nissan. Not the greatest. Not my particular thing, unless it's a GTR, a Godzilla. I don't particularly care about it. Nissans, that is, at least. I have to talk really loud because the music is crazy. We got some small little Suzuki cars. I don't know where win, win, win. I mean, I'm not hard to lose. I'm the biggest guy here. Got a monk. Just chilling. Oh, you're behind. <laughs> it's a Swift. I wonder what the spec sheet is on the Swift. I don't see one for it. Pretty basic car. It looks like it could potentially be fast. The orange Swift. This is the price? This is the price? So like 20,000. So that's like 20,000 US. Let's see if they have any actual sports cars. Yeah, like if they actually have one sports car here. Look, what we got Volvo. This is going to be expensive. So that's like 60,000 US dollars. What?
so loud for a fucking car show now. Great. Let's check out what uh, Mercedes bought over. Like a male model. and I'll confirm them and I'll write them out as we go by. Let's see what a G-Wagon goes for. All right, so the G-Wagon is 10, hey, 10 billion, 600. So like 300,000, huh? So around like 300,000 for an AMG G-Wagon. You can buy three of those in America for that. It looks like Subaru might have bought an STI or two. We'll, we'll take a look. They might be one of the first uh, companies trying to emerge in like the more affordable race car market. We'll find out. I'm not an STI guy. Seems that you can buy any of these cars here, which is different than a car show in America. Uh, I've seen quite a few cars with the sold sign on the front of it. I have owned one Mercedes in life. It was uh, 2016, uh, I want to say, E350. Nice car, too expensive, waste of money. 1.6. So let's, let's, let's go over to Volkswagen. Maybe they bought something fast. I doubt it. Ford's got the little Ranger Raptor out here, it looks like. You actually see these a lot in uh, Saigon. It's the Ranger Raptor. Some kind of hammer package. They put wheels and other shit on it. Volkswagen just bought the standard library. Nothing crazy. Some Tegans. Uh, base model cheaper. Let's see. Nothing really fancy. Uh, the GTS. Not the special one. Uh, maybe a turbo beetle. They're calling it the Beetle Dune. I'm assuming it might be turbo though. Let's 
let's try to get to the specs on the front of it. Volkswagen's got the hottest chick, so I'll give it that. This chick's like, why this tour at? She's a hottie. This chick with the short hair is a hottie. Let's see who else is a hottie. Nope, we got a picture taken of the hotties. Okay, let's walk in front. Could be a good thumbnail right there. I might get beat out for the thumbnail. <laughs> She's hot too. She's got like a model look. Thank you. She might win thumbnail. She might got beat out. <laughs> So we're slowly inching over to uh, Subaru. I'm most excited if, if Honda bought uh, uh, Type R and if Subaru bought maybe an STI. We'll see. Oh, they got some white chicks here too. We're, we're culturally blended here. Oh, shit. I just cut in front of a bunch of people's pictures. Some kind of ugly Ford SUV. It's like maybe four uh, forms of explorer. Yeah. I am not a Land Rover, Range Rover guy, but we'll take a look and see what they got. I'm trying to kind of go through the car show pretty quickly so it's not like too long of a video. It's the smallest car show I've ever seen by far. Got a model guy. <laughs> I like how they're keeping it uh, appropriate. They're blending in both male and female models. I've not seen that in America. Got Jaguar making a little appearance here. I don't see the nice Jag though, the F-Type. Uh... Oh, there it is. They got one. These cars, these F-Types are so popular in uh, California. There's, oh, just, you see, I don't even know. In LA, you see, I kid you not, hundreds of these per day. Very popular. Let's see what the Jaguar girl looks like. She's a dope chick. She has ass tons of makeup on. This guy's got his SLR out. Power photo in. Thank you. I have a plethora of thumbnails to choose from. So they did, so Subaru bought out a BRZ, but they didn't bring out an STI. That's weird. Let's look and see what a BRZ goes for here. It's one of the few cars that you can actually buy here that's uh, like a entry level sports car. Let's see. Hopefully they have a price. How much? How much? No, no price? It looks like a standard livery uh, BRZ. Some guy just popped the trunk. It's got a full spare though, that's cool. I am absolutely not a fan of these cars. I hate boxer motors. I've never been a fan of boxer motors, and I never will be. To work on, they don't handle large amounts of power well. When you do upgrade the power on them, it costs a shit ton of money. It is not the car for me, never has. 
So hopefully we're at Honda and they got something cool. I was really hoping that they would bring out uh, a Type R, but I don't see one. I already don't see the big ass wing anywhere, so we'll take a look and see what we got. One car though, that's weird. So an RS VTEC Turbo, four door, automatic. <clears throat> Probably some form of the turbo K series. What is this? Thing? Is this a little jazz? What do they call it here? What do they call the Honda Fit here? It looks like a fit. Like a turbo fit. I swear I saw a turbo on it. Let's see if it wears no RS livery. They call it a Brio. Brio RS. Let's see if it's got an automatic gearbox. Yes. Cheap interior, just like a Honda Fit looks like. A nice little entertainment. Concept. Concept. It's an interesting 
idea. It's a bit bulky. It looks like somebody let their 10 year old design it. I don't ever see this going into production. Okay, that's enough of that. So the last thing we'll take a look at for 22 minutes, so it's going to be about a 30 minute video, which is perfect. We'll take a look at this. This has a snorkel on it. I see a wench, a Wineland wench on the back. We got some Toyo tires on it. It looks like it's on a six inch lift, maybe. It's got a roll cage in it. Maybe like a cross country rally. Yeah, it's, a, it's like a Baja rally style truck. I don't know if the livery inside the motor's been updated, but not a bad looking truck. They're calling it the Triton. Oh, it's, it's, it's been on the road for sure. You can see where the uh, intercooler radiator's got some uh, miles on it. There's the snorkel, and the snorkel's for if you get the car all the way underwater. The intake is still above everything, so you don't uh, hydro lock the motor. Not particularly too impressive. Looks like a tire rack in the back. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's gonna be it for the uh, Vietnam Saigon car show. Uh, it's a very small car show. It took me, let's see, 23 minutes to get through the entire car show. There was, oh, sorry. And there wasn't too many very exciting cars, maybe a handful, three or four. Toyota's got a pretty cool graphic right here. It's like very Blade Runner looking here. They don't have any fast. Toyota were weird too, they got all white girls. <laughs> what?
Thưa quý vị, mẫu xe được sở hữu với hình mạnh mẽ, phong cách, hệ thống khung cầm trầm chắc, thiết kế nội thất tiện nghi, khu khả năng trở thành bên bỉ và thiên ái, hệ thống tiêu diệt đồng hệ sử do phép. Alright, we're in the Vin Group, Vin Fast tent at the Vietnam Saigon car show. Let's take a look at their cars. They're actually pretty decent looking car, man. Got some EDM pumping. A20 turbo. Nice, so it's got a little 2.0 liter turbo. It's actually a good looking car. Sitting on 245 40s. The front end looks nice. Looks like a, an Accord, kind of. Or maybe like the big four-door Genesis. Decent looking car. Take a look at the SUV. It's sold. Got an iPad in here. It's another 2.0 liter turbo. One billion five hundred. Win. How much is 1.5 billion? 50,000? 50, so it's 50,000 US dollars. Let's see, let's take a look at the car and see how much the car is. So the car, how much is 1 billion? 40? Let's take a look at the interior. Wow, it's got like a Tesla. Tesla style display, just a little smaller. Literally, it just looks exactly like an iPad tucked in there. I mean, it's nice though. We don't have premium calipers or anything. Maybe two pots up front, I'm not sure. It's okay. Let's check out the little SUV. Let's see what's in this sucker. Is that the right price? Yes. So that's cheap. That's like what? Thirty thousand? Huh? Twenty thousand US. But I mean, you can see the quality is taking a significant down crease on this one. Still got like some kind of fake premium leather. Hold on, let's see. Hi. <laughs> Nice little interior. I mean, it's cheap. You can tell it's got like that Hyundai base model feel to it with the cheap plastic center console. Cheap gauge. Let's see what the quality. Feels nice though. I mean, for the price, you can't beat it. I mean, I think they're making a pretty impressive showing. This is their first year for all these, right? They're just introducing all these cars? Uh, they haven't had... This year or this year, they won. So they got some kind of racing simulator over here. Yeah. I want to buy tickets for this. I'm going to go to this. Find out how much the tickets are for the whole weekend. What she said? Yeah. Uh, how much? So. You're interested? So we have the price in BND and in also in dollars. Gotcha. Have a look. And one ticket? One ticket. I don't know. Uh, F1 racing? F1, yeah. yeah. In Hanoi. Uh, I want to go to this. It's not for a while. It's not till like next year, right? 
Yeah, it's not until uh, April next year. Yeah, it's April next year. So yeah, so you can just see. So here are the premium brand stand. Right. Standard. Unreserved. Gotcha. This is the unreserved here. Yeah, the green one. This is a good stretch to be on though. I can take this? Sure. Awesome. Take one of these as well. Thank you. Come on. What? <laughs> Try the helmet. <laughs> Try the helmet. Try the helmet. Yeah. Like this? Yeah. <laughs>